Hi, my name is Abbott, and I'm going to teach you how to paint with watercolor using the negative painting technique. Now, watercolor is very transparent, so um, whereas with acrylic paint or oil paint, you can go back in afterwards and add your whites, but with watercolor, you need to plan ahead which areas you're going to leave white. So I've squeezed out a few colors of tube watercolor onto my palette. Watercolor also comes in trays. And I'm going to take my lightest color, which is yellow, and just outline the area that I would like to leave white. Or the areas I would like to leave white. And once you've outlined those areas, you can cover everywhere else on your paper with water. And the exciting thing about watercolor is when you put it down over a watered down area or a water covered area, it kind of bleeds together but avoids the dry areas of the paper, as you'll see in a minute. See how the watercolor bleeds out only up into the edge of the, of the wet area and it avoids the dry area. And you can add a couple colors, let them all kind of bleed together. And your white area or your negative space will remain untouched by paint. My name is Abbott, and I just showed you how to paint using the negative paint technique.